Shadow of the Stone episode 3. Hello everybody, I'm Wolf and I watch classic kids TV shows, movies and running TV drama shows, serials, type things. <laughs> so, this is episode 3. What have we learned so far? We're starting to learn that Liz, Lizzie, Elizabeth is an incarnation of sorts of a witch because you've seen her trying to push the stone. So she wants to really, really be on the boat and she wants really, really hard on the Granny Kimpok stone. Is that what it's called? Her boyfriend is a stalker. She's brought the guy Steve Lamont to meet her gran to get some history about his family. I'm not sure quite what else is going on at the moment. So like and subscribe, follow me on the platforms and Let's just get straight on with this episode. What did you call it again? Smog, because he's like a dragon. I wouldn't let Danny touch him. Perhaps he wouldn't want to. That's a good point. Don't you like him? Well, he's not everybody's idea of a pet. My familiar. Oh, he's a familiar? He even knows I'm not Liz. Really. He knows who I am inside. I'm a witch. She's a witch. Bernard. Who are you? She weighs the same as a you duck. to know. Mary. Got oh, more flashbacks. Oh, what should have been? Why is she went red? Better her try and burn him. A lassie cannot turn the tide. Send to me a fine wee boat to cross the sea. Oh, so that's what she wished for. A little topsail schooner called Granny Kempa. There's a wee fishing boat by that name. This one's steel. Built in 1890s. In Greenock, I think. So how would he know? You sail, Tom? No. He just paddles around in the harbour. He's into fishing. You're her mother. You must tell her. You're closer to it. Do you know if I can get a train to Glasgow tomorrow morning? Yes. They're on pretty often. Why? You know, I've nothing to do tomorrow. Are you sure I can't come? Mm -hmm. Quite sure. I've been looking at some wee flats and I think I might have found one that I like. Oh, she's moving out. What's wrong with her now? Do you think you'll find your old boat, the Granny Kempock? I don't know. I'm hoping. She was young. Not much older than me. And she wanted to go to sea. Oh my God. Father was a fisherman, but it was 1661. They wouldn't let. How did she know it was 1661? Did they keep records of the years back then? Why wouldn't they let her go to sea? Superstition. Women, bad luck on boats. No of rubbish. Oh, the witches. And they go again. Why do people spoil everything? I was wrong now. She's out on the boat sailing, what's the problem? Don't laugh at me! They said it was unlucky to take a woman out on a boat. It was unnatural, they said. Why? I expect they kept telling him so. Why? His family, his friends. Who? Whose friends? A boyfriend. The fisherman who loved Mary Lamont. Oh, she murdered him. Her father told her she'd need to go into service. He got her a place, he said. Proper women's work. What he meant was a skivvy. Washing pots and pans and dirty dishes. And what then? Oh, she'd marry maybe a fisher lad so she could gather in the mussels in the cold dawn and have endless kids but never go to sea. Well, she's got a grudge to hold, didn't she? Just because her ancestor never got to go to sea. I hate them. They're all going to die. She hated Granny Kimpock more. <gasps> all that promise. All those wishes. She felt betrayed. That's a real Granny. The old stone just stood there. Don't tell me the stone was Granny Kimpock. He drowned, you see.
This is a kid's show. The boy who'd taken Mary Lamont to sea in the first place. He drowned. She was a witch. Oh, that she based the same as a duck. I said that last time. <laughs> it was great. I can't describe the feeling when the boat. That's good. You got your trip then. It's about your mum and Danny. Yes. They've decided to get married. Shocker. I didn't expect to see you. I thought you couldn't tear yourself away from Mr. Freedom. <laughs> you don't have to stay then. Don't touch it! Tom, come away! Why? It's drowned. Drowned as a doll. Today, Guruk Bay, tomorrow. Who knows? I'm not in the mood for that. I shouldn't have done that. This is going to run away and turn you into stone. My mum is going to get married again. Anyway, it'll never happen. That's twice you've said that. I'll get Steve to take you out in the boat. Steve? Mr Lamont. He'll do most things I ask him. Oh, I. Okay, did you actually do that with the, your fisherman friend who died? <laughs> and that was Shadow of the Stone episode 3. <laughs> so... She's convinced that she is the spirit of the witch who tried to push the Granny Kempok stone into the River Clyde. What did you think of this episode? Did you like this show? I can't believe that's me just. I knew that was her. I knew that was the actress that plays Moan and Myrtle. And I'll tell you what her name is. Her name is. Do -do 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 -do. Shirley Henderson. I knew, I knew it was her. I did Alan Cummings, Charlie Henderson. That was really good. Let's see if there's anything else about this show that I should know. She was put on trial. Oh, we never got that far yet. She was put on trial for witchcraft. Oh, I guess this was going to happen in the next episodes. So, anyway, let me know what you think. Like and subscribe. Follow me on the platforms. And let me know what you think about this episode. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next episode. Cheers, cheers.